हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू एल आर माय नेम इज समीर सरदाना एंड आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट दिस 100 मसल रीजनिंग क्वेश्चंस फॉर स्नैप सीरीज कंसीडरिंग द लेवल ऑफ डिफिकल्टी व्हिच वाज आस्क्ड इन स्नैप पेपर व्हिच वाज रिसेंटली कंडक्टेड आई हैव सिलेक्टेड दीस 100 क्वेश्चंस कवरिंग ऑल द टॉपिक्स ऑफ रीजनिंग सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद द फर्स्ट टॉपिक इन द पार्ट 1 आई विल बी पिकिंग द टॉपिक ऑफ कोडिंग एंड डीकोडिंग सो हियर इज द फर्स्ट सेट ऑफ क्वेश्चन दैट वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग is it question of decoding and decoding so in these type of question right uh, this exactly type of question which was asked in snap paper right two years back that in a certain code language a particular sentence is coded as a combination of numbers symbol and letter so you are supposed to decode the pattern on which uh, on the basis of which this complete sentences has been coded now look at it you see that the codes are made of three things one is the number right the second are the symbols and third are the letters so how do you approach these type of questions right numbers if you see are 8 7 and 6 these are the three numbers that this complete you know a uh, a uh, set is using either the number has been used as 8 or 7 or 6 and if you look at the symbols the symbols are at the right factorial a dollar sign and the asterisk sign so these are the four symbol that this complete set is using and the letters you can see are x c l k and so on so how do you get to know what exactly is the rule of using the number 8 what exactly is the rule of using the symbol at the right and what exactly are the rules for the letters right this is something that you need to decode all right so how do you approach these type of questions so what you have to see is you look for the common numbers you look for those codes which have the common number or they have the common symbol right it's always better to start with the symbol right if you look at these words if you look at these questions right if you look at these all these codes you see that you can easily observe it that this particular code and this particular code right all these code are using the same symbol and that's eight the root so you need to see that what are those words for which these code these codes have been used kon kon se aise words hain jinke liye ye code use ho rahe hain और उनके अंदर ऐसा कौन सा कॉमन पॉइंट है विच कॉमन पॉइंट लाइज अमंग ऑल दिस वर्ड फॉर विच वी आर यूजिंग द सेम सिंबल दैट इज एट द रेट एट दिस पॉइंट ऑफ टाइम वी डोंट इवन नो दैट दिस पर्टिकुलर दिस पर्टिकुलर कोड हैज बीन यूज्ड फॉर विच पर्टिकुलर वर्ल्ड राइट सो एक किस वर्ड के लिए यूज हो रहा है वी डोंट नो दैट सो सी दैट इफ यू लुक एट द लेटर जनरली इन ऑल दिस टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन लेटर इज समथिंग दैट इज रिलेटेड to the total or uh, the, the number is generally related to the number of letters in the word if you look at first sentence the word remix has five letters magic have five le- letters the word ball has four letters and the word jack has four letters and if you observe it carefully the let numbers that have been used here are 8 Eight, seven, and seven. Can you find some relation out of it? Yes, you can see that all these numbers are three plus compared to these numbers, right? Okay. Now to cross verify, to cross verify, just pick any other sentence. Look at this. In the word Jeep, it has four letters. Mad has three letters. Bad has three letters. Rain has four letters. And if you look at these symbols, you see that these are four, six, six, seven. This is also matching exactly. that's 3 plus then the number of letters so you see that we have now decoded the rule for using a number so what do we have in this complete set the rule for using a number is basically adding 3 to the number of letters now this is a rule that you have to keep in mind so just note it down that number rule is right for any code the number rule is right the number have been used as number of letters number of letters in the word plus 3 so this is the first rule that we have decoded now you see that here 
this number is x here right so it must have been used here for remix or magic and if you see that the letter here is c so you can clearly see the rule for the rule for writing down a letter at the end of the chord is actually the last alphabet so you see alphabet alphabet that we are using or the letter that we are using is the last letter is the last letter of the of the of the given word for which you are trying to find out the code now remix for remix we have used a symbol at the rate okay and for magic we have used the symbol factorial right now try to find out a code which is using the same symbol and then try to find out a common pattern or a, or any common property that two words will be having now at the rate is used here and you can see that this must be used for rail now what is common between remix and rail right so what is common that you can see in remix and rail that both of them are using the same symbol as at the rate you see that the common thing between these two words is that it is also starting with r and it is also starting with r so that tell us the rule that r if if a particular word is starting with r we are supposed to use the the symbol at the rate now similarly you see that factorial is because of magic so that means if a word is starting with a letter m i have to use the i have to use a symbol that is factorial and dollar has been used for the letter b you can also cross check it whether all the words which have the first letter as b are having the symbol of dollar or not you see that bad here is having the symbol dollar right so you can cross verify it easily also and if a particular word is starting with the letter j the symbol that you're supposed to use is the asterisk sign that's it now you can solve all the question in the question number one we are supposed to answer what does this code stand for now you see that seven means the number of letter in that particular word must be four this also tell that this must be four this also tell that the number of letters in the third word is also four so that option is my answer where in every word the number of letters are four now look at the questions this option straight away can be eliminated this option straight away can be eliminated this option can be eliminated only this is the possible answer and because all of these words are starting with the letter r so therefore the symbol should also be at the rate anyways you don't go you, you don't need to go to the you, you don't need to go to checking the symbol you can straight away answer the question only with the first rule that is a rule of the number numbers are number of letter plus three so whatever the number of letters that that uh, that a particular word have plus three is the code for that particular word so for example here you see we have four word letter so the number used should be seven here four letter word that means number should be seven four letter word the number should be seven and then you can apply the rule of symbol and then finally you can also apply the rule of the letter that that we are using over here this was a type of questions from the previous year snap paper this question is exactly not similar to that i have just selected this question but snap once asked this type of coding and decoding question which i personally uh, uh, feel that can be asked again in the upcoming exam of 6 january and 9 january so let's solve the remaining questions also and complete this set what is the code of race back mom okay now see that the number of letters here are four so code of it should be starting with seven the number of letters are four so code sh should be started with seven this particular is uh, uh, this word particular word is having three letters so the code should start with six so seven seven six should be should the whatever option is the answer right the numbers that it should be having be seven seven and six so this option is eliminated this option is eliminated so we are left with only these two options now we can go for the symbol right for the word r i need to use the symbol at the rate for the word for the letter b you can see that as per the rule b means dollar sign so this should be having a dollar sign and m means you can see that for m we use the symbol factorial so it should be having factorial so these are the three symbols that the option should be having at the rate dollar and 
factorial at the rate dollar and factorial at the rate dollar and factorial both of them are having the same symbols but then you also need to cross check you also need to cross check that if the last letter is k if the last letter is k the symbol should be as per the rule of b and for as per the rule of b the symbol should be dollar so with k you need to use a dollar sign with k you need to use a dollar sign but here in the first option with k we have factorial so d is the correct answer of the question right all right moving on to the next question what is the code for many jump round see use the letter code uh, number code first the number of number that should be used for the coding of many it should be 7 here it should be 7 here it should be 8 so 7 7 8 so this option can be eliminated okay now let's look at the last letter the last letter is y here the last letter is p here the last letter is d here so the letters used in the code should be y p d y p d y p d y p d okay all are same right so now we need to go to the symbol rule for m you see that for m we have the code of factorial okay so this should have a factorial here so with y to use factorial with y we need to use factorial so this option is eliminated now let's look for the code of j if you look the code of j it's asterisks right so this sign so with p you need to use this sign with p you need to use this right so this option is eliminated a is the correct answer of the question let's go to the next question question number four what does the code this represent you see that here eight means the number of letters should be five number of letter in the word should be five again this should five so the sentence for which this code has been used should be having five letters each having three words with five letters each five letters five letters five okay this also have five letters okay this is five 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 okay all options are valid option as per the number of letters okay now you need to see that the last letter the the last letter is represented by the last letter of the word here so can i say that all these three words that i'm looking for should be ending with o c and t as a number of letter so o c and t you see that this is d so this is eliminated this is e so this is eliminated this is d so this is eliminated and you are left with only this option that is option number one a is the correct answer of the question so this is the method of solving the coding and decoding question this is one type of coding and decoding there are a number of different questions right uh, of coding and decoding which i'll be covering in the upcoming sessions but this is the kind of set that i'm expecting and everyone should know this right now in the upcoming topic we'll be covering questions from the different different topics right so this was the first session of 100 muscle reasoning questions guys i'm teaching live on unacademy plus and there's an iconic membership that you can go for if you want looking for unacademy plus subscription and these are the benefits of iconic subscription that you will be assigned a personal mentor for your exam preparation there will be a test analysis and the reports will be submitted to you and you'll also be given the suggestion by your personal mentor what are the different areas that you need to look into and how do you how to improve those uh, uh, weak areas and what are the different topics that you need to work upon so you will be guided personally by the mentor that will be assigned to you under the iconic membership uh, there will be another other mba entrance test exam preparation also all benefits of plus subscriptions are included right so you will be get mentored by the graduate from the top b schools also there's a new feature that we have added on our academy uh, a learning app that you you can ask your doubt anytime 24 hours 7 all you have to do is just to click the questions which you are not able to solve highlight the question that you want us to solve and you are supposed to send it and you will get your solution and this this option is active on in your learning app 24 hours 7 so this option is live and you can ask your doubts anytime that you want to ask your doubts from your mentors thank you so much for watching this video and if you're looking for iconic subscription please use the referral code LRDI Samir. this will help you in getting 10 percent off on an academy plus subscription as well as on iconic subscription Thank you so much. See you then in the next part of the video. Thank you.